Alrighty then. Hey, this is Wentis yet again. I'm going to be continuing my Let's Play of Captain Toad Treasure Tracker. Last episode, we started the chase to Pyropuff Peak. Rather, we continued it. Well, no. No, we did start it last episode. Sorry, I'm getting confused. We took on the Double Cherry Palace and Shy Guy Heights. We managed to get 100% on both, and this episode, we're going to be continuing on to the Spin Wheel Library. Let's check it out. I wonder what the condition is going to be for this. Because so far, I have not actually figured out what I'm supposed to do before I get to the end. This is interesting. I like the bookish look of this place. Ooh, that's a pipe. That's our first time seeing one of those. I see a gem hidden there. I don't know how to get to it. Gem hidden there. Also don't know how to get to it. Let's start out by... Well, let's go to what's already available to us to start off instead of immediately hopping onto that spin wheel. Let's see what's down here. Oh, it reverses the gravity. That's interesting. What's up with you, buddy? Okay, so these are... This is the Toad Brigade here. There's, oh, and it looks like, as usual, the Blue Toad actually has another gem for us. Hmm, interesting. What's in here, though? Oh, a gold mushroom. Very nice. So that's an additional 50, coin, 50 coins for us. So let's go ahead and head back up. Yeah, I'm glad I didn't do the spin wheel immediately, because that would have closed this area off, and I'm not sure if I could have gotten it back. So. Okay, spinning it is rotating that. Let's try and put it just like that for now. I bet if we turned it further, we'd get a different result. But let's try this first. We have to be on it to spin it. Oh! Oh, wait, no, we can't get to those. All right, so we can't just stay up here and rotate it. That would probably cause problems, actually, considering the abyss below us. This is a pretty fun puzzle game, I gotta say. It does make me kind of think through what I'm going to do. And it, so far, it hasn't partic been particularly challenging. Oh, and there's a new result that I was thinking of. Yeah, it hasn't been really challenging, but it's been fun. Which is good. It definitely should be fun before challenging. But... I'm hoping it does get a bit more challenging as it goes. I'm missing a gem. I know there's more coins over here, but where is that gem? I know I spotted one somewhere. You know, I bet I know where it is. I bet that if I were to rotate this again... Aha! Just as I thought. Now let's go ahead and get this... Actually, we probably... Yeah, we can just do it back the other way. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Let's see what we had to do to get 100%, though. 89 seems like an odd number of coins. Literally an odd number of coins to get for a level. I'm not surprised if it had something to do with the coins. Probably has to do with the number of rotations. Oh, collect the gold mushroom. That's all there is to it. We did that. So yeah, I knew I'd do it eventually. That I get 100% on the first try. So that's done with, and we've unlocked... Oh, what's this? That's a golden ticket. Oh, Coins Galore, a special mission by the looks of it. Best coin run. Let's see what this is. It seems to be some sort of bonus level. Okay. Oh. oh, I recognize those purple blocks. Oh, just gives me a mushroom. Okay. Okay, this one has a picture of a pickaxe over, and this one has a picture of a double cherry. I'll go from left to right. Oh, I get what we're doing here. Pow blocking. Oh, I should have done that in such a way that it was near the others. Oh, yeah, I shouldn't have wasted that second pow block, but that's still a good number of coins. It just kind of... Oh, does this go away now? It does go away now. So we only get one shot at that. Still, that was kind of fun getting some extra coins for that. Minecart Tunnel Throwdown. Ooh, this is going to be our first time using the minecart. I remember seeing this in the trailers. Let's see what we can do. Ooh, I like the underground look of this place and the water down below. This is cool looking, and there's a lot of turnips in that minecart. Oh, and I spot something behind us. Nope. I wanted to go back. Oh, uh, apparently I'm aiming with the gamepad. So we can't get that guy. Sorry, you guys can't see what I'm seeing. Uh, I wish I had a camera aimed at this, because I'm basically just aiming with a little circle in the middle of my screen. It looks like those fly pretty straight. 
I bet if I sh okay, if I shoot stuff, then I gather it. So it looks like I missed out on that first gem back there because I'm supposed to shoot it. Oh, I missed out on killing that guy. Nope. Uh, ah. Come on. Ah, I didn't get the gem. Man, I'm missing all the gems today. Nope. I'm gonna get this one, though. Nope. I guess I'm not. Ah, that's so awkward to turn. Oh, jeez. This is really weird. Oh, I can... Oh, if I had known, I could have turned with the right control stick instead of having to use motion controls. I would have been doing that from the start. Oh, jeez. That was bad. I did horrible. I missed all three gems. Uh, let's just gather a star and let's try that again, shall we? Yeah, I bet there was something behind me on that slope. Course clear, but not complete. At least we get to know what our... Oh, defeat all the parabitty buds. That's actually going to be kind of challenging. It looks like we unlocked two levels again. Hmm. Still, let's head back in there and try this again. Now that I know that I can use the right control stick, this should be a lot easier. Okay, we drop into that. Now, go directly behind us. There we go. Let's take you out. Take out that. Let's try to shoot at things, like, way away. Just so we can get at them ahead of time, so that we don't have to be aiming in a hurry as we go past them. Let's focus on taking out the enemies, actually. Those coins are nice, but not necessary. Barely got him. Okay. So let's try to get this. Okay, that's second gem. Now we just need to get those Parabitty Buds. I actually, oh, looks like we got all of them. Let's just see if we can't get that gem. Whew, barely got it. Let's try to get all of those. Oh, more coins there. That's nice. I think we actually just did that 100% now. So yeah, that was a lot better than I thought it would be. I, I can't... I wish I could sh turn the screen on the main screen. I'm very sorry that I can't do that. I don't also I also don't have a camera to show what's on the control pad. I didn't realize this game would have moments like that. I apologize. That's been my hesitation with recording games for the Wii U. And yep, just I thought there was stuff back here. My hesitation has always been um, that I wouldn't be able to show the full experience because a lot of games require the gamepad. Not all of them, though. There are some games that I intend to do in the future that do not require the gamepad, but yeah. Still, that's done with there, and we're not even to 10 minutes yet. I think we have enough time for another episode. Or another level. Spin wheel, bullet, build, base, and... Oh, okay, the King of Pyropuff Peak. That sounds like a boss battle, but it requires a certain number of gems, which we have more than enough. But we're doing this all 100% if I can, that is. So let's take this on. Ooh, if I hear bullet bills over there for sure. These look like they should be moving like treadmills. Not sure why they're not. Let's see what this does, though. Rotating this turns those. So let's go ahead and get this one here. If we head up there... Hmm. Huh. Oh, I just realized there's a turn wheel up there, but it's being fired at by bullet bills. Let's try to do this. Oh, shoot, he immediately just drops on us again. Oh, but he got taken out by a bullet bill. That makes it so that we can wait properly. Wait for it, and go! Now try to rotate immediately. Oh, if I can aim the bullet bills. But if I turn them just a bit further... Perfect. Now how do I get over there? Oh, I bet I have to just... Actually, let's try first aim this over here, because I bet I can clear a pathway for myself on the other side. Does that hit those? Yes, it does. Perfect. So I'll be clearing away for myself later. But let's aim these in such a way that they won't be aimed at me while I'm going across there. So now that has been nullified and we get a gem out of it too. Don't want to fall into that lava. I'm not so far we like we can't fall off the edge in these games, but I bet we could fall into that lava. Hmm. No, I just noticed a little secret passageway on there. So I think we're supposed to go up this way. How are we supposed to get over to there? I bet I can trick these guys into hitting these things for me. Yep. Come on, come hit me. Come get me. Come and get it. 
Thanks for the help. And one more. Third time's charm. Nope. Over here, maybe? Over here? Come on. Don't get me. There you go. Okay. Now. Where do I go from here? I bet I have to rotate that. Which will do what exactly? What does this rotate? Okay, rotate that. Oh, jeez! No, 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 no! <laughs> okay, let's try and aim that so it takes out those blocks there. So it kind of at a diagonal. Ah, no. Yep, there we go. Let's see right about there, maybe? No, not quite. Now, the timing on this is really awkward. Ah, come on. It's not consistently firing at the same spot. It's consistently... The block is in a different spot, I think, every time that I fire this, so it's kind of difficult to time it. There we go. Now, let's not aim that towards ourselves, like a smart person. Now, let's try doing... What exactly? Oh, I bet I, I... I see, I have to do it like that. But what happens if I go over there? Oh, there's a gem over there. Okay, that's why I was clearing that path. I knew there had to be a reason. Now, how do I get to the gem in that staircase? Oh, I know! I have to go back up there. Oh, that's going to be a bit of a pain, but I can manage it. If I go back up there and rotate that staircase differently, I didn't even notice that there was a gem there. That's kind of cleverly hidden, but it does make me go back, which is annoying. Let's try and get past this bullet bill now. Oh, I can't get back up there. Shoot, I'm going to have to redo this level. That's a shame. Oh, well, let's go ahead and get this there. Run past. Up through here. Wait a minute. Actually, can I make that jump? No, I can't. That's when I rotate this. Oh my god. That is unexpected. Oh, there's a star. It's a shame I can't get back to get that first gem. But I'm going to redo this level and get that done. Because it's pretty obvious how it's done. Still, let's gather our star and let's see what the 100% is. I like how his shoes are actually kind of shining due to the lava. And his hat looks kind of... has an orange glow to it. Golden mushroom? What golden mushroom? I guess I'm going to be searching for a golden mushroom. Where could one possibly be, though, in this place? I got all three of those blocks down there. Let's move this, this way. Now I see that that's there. So, where would a golden mushroom be in this place? Wait a minute. I know where it is. No? No, it wouldn't be there. I guess we'll just have to try to search every nook and cranny of this place. Hmm. I'm actually going to cut ahead and let you guys know when I find it. Oh, I actually got my first game over. Or not so much game over, I lost a life. That sucks. Aha! Found it. That's where it was. Just had to rotate that a little bit further than I actually did. So let's go ahead and get out of here now. Whew, that actually took a bit longer than I expected. But that's done with now. I'm glad I got that... Well... Finished! And that's 100% so far. I'm worried that I'm going to come across a puzzle that I just can't figure out. I mean, there's... This game is still really new, and obviously there's not going to be guides for it everywhere. So, and there's probably some guides out here on it, or on the internet about it, but... I don't know, I think I can probably figure this out on my own. Whether I can or cannot, though, and... Actually, that brings up a good point. If it ever does come to a point when I can't find anything, I'd love to hear from you guys and have you guys explain to me where it is. Like, I mean, I know at least one of you has played through this game, or played this game. So maybe you know where it is and I don't. Either way, though, that is going to be it for this episode. And if you did enjoy and you would like to uh, help me out, leave a comment letting me know what you think about the video. And if, also, if you did enjoy it, leave a like or a favorite. And if you'd like to see more, feel free to subscribe. Or don't. Either way, really. But this has been Wentus. 
I truly do hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys next time when we continue this game of Captain Toad Treasure Tracker. See you then!